Hey guys, I'm bringing you guys a special video today. Um, I'm going to be teaching you how to levitate a card and make it float out of the palm of your hand. And you can show this as close-up magic to any of your family and friends. And it's a simple trick and it's a great effect, so just enjoy. And um, I hope you get a lot of fun out of this one. Okay, so I have a card. I'm going to place it in the palm of my hand, okay? I'm going to place it in the palm of my hand. Now, I want you to watch very closely, okay? Because I'm going to levitate this card out of my hand, okay? So keep watching. Keep watching. And then, that's how you levitate the card. Very simple trick. Um, let me just show you that one more time. Um, maybe I can get a better angle, okay? Floats right off your hand. Okay, I back down. Okay, now I'm going to show you guys the secret behind this trick. And the secret is that it's a gimmick card, okay? You have a thin piece of plastic here. It has to be thick enough where it'll be sturdy but yet flexible, okay? And it's going to be here just like this. So, um,. My advice to you is it, Christmas is over, so I'm pretty sure a lot of you got a lot of Christmas gifts and a lot of presents. So, and I, I just bought some um, some earbuds actually, some earphones, and um, I have some plastic just from like uh, most electronics have this kind of plastic, you know, and this is um, perfect, perfect for this trick. And I'm going to use the outside plastic, and you're just going to cut it, make it longer than you think the card is, because you can always just trim it from the card. So here we have it, okay? And then you're just going to take the card and trim it to the very edges, okay? Just like follows. You don't want it to hang over the edge, okay? You might even want to cut it um, exactly to the edge. That way it doesn't go over. You don't want it to go over like that, okay? You want it exactly to the edge. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take some glue and you're gonna put the glue right in the middle. Super glue works fine. Um, if you don't have it, you you can um, try other things that you can think that will keep it to stick. But my best bet is to just use a little bit of super glue and some. Um, so you put it right in the middle and just put it right dab in the middle. Don't make too much of it because then it won't work. And then you place your plastic piece directly horizontally in the center of the card. Okay, and you press it down. And you're gonna want it to let it dry. Let it dry for at least an hour or so, you know, just so you don't ruin it. Because if you do it and it comes off, you're going to have to wait a whole another hour again. So just let it sit. Be patient. And then when you get it back, the finished product is going to look like the card I was using. And it just has the flap here. So you should be able to, to pull the plastic pieces like this to make it look like it's floating, okay? And then from there, that point on, you place the card. Make sure you don't show the back to the spectator, okay? Because you can obviously see this. So you can lay it down and just show them like it's one card, you know, and then you're going to place it in between. This is the tricky part. You're going to place it in between the crook of your, the bottom of your pinky right here and the, and right here and the crook of your thumb and your pointer finger right here. So you're going to place it kind of diagonally because you want to grasp it like this. Okay. And if you have your and thumb, make sure your thumb's pointing out like this. Don't leave it in like that. Make sure it's pointing out. And then all you do is squeeze your hand inward, okay? You just squeeze your hand inward like this, and it makes it float. And make sure your angles are right so they don't see it. But as you can see, you can't really see my thumb moving because I'm not using my thumb like this, okay? I'm keeping it straight. I'm just using the pressure from the sides of where I'm putting in it and just moving it up. And if you do it slow enough, they're not going to see it. Now, if I do it fast, you'll see what I'm doing. So um, just practice this trick. You want to practice your angles, and you want to practice in front of a mirror. Make sure you don't show the gimmick. And you want to practice the placement of where you want to place it in your hand. And if you practice, 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 you know, it does make it doesn't always make perfect. But, <laughs> um, well, that's the truth. But it doesn't, it makes for less error. You're going to, if you practice this trick, you, there's no problem you should have when you're performing this to your friends. So I hope you have a lot of fun with this trick. And um, I hope my video explained this perfectly well for you. So. 
Any questions, comments, ratings, please do below. And um, subscribe, please, if you like this channel. Thank you guys for watching.